welcome back to another video. It's your girl Diavia, aka Didi. In today's video, I'm going to be doing what's in my hospital bag video. So if you guys are new, welcome to my channel. Hey girl, hey, you're here for a reason. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Y'all are probably wondering why my mouth is blue because I had a popsicle and I didn't think about that when I was about to record. So I was like, um, oh, my mouth is blue now. So that is why my mouth is blue. But yeah, so today's video is going to be a what's in my hospital bag video. And I will be doing a separate video for baby girl uh bag as well and yes if you are new to my channel i am pregnant hey yes i am pregnant i am 35 weeks right now i'll be 36 weeks on thursday so it's getting it's getting close to time so i was like um let me go ahead and shoot this video so you guys can see what i'm going to be taking to the hospital with me i am a first time mom i do not have any children other than my my baby my fur baby my dog but yeah so i was like let me go ahead and do this video for you guys um christian bags already packed i did not need to record that because he's not the important one here i'm the important one here so um yes yeah, so i'm going to be doing this video for my bag and then another video for baby girl's bag and then um i'm definitely going to be doing a nursery tour soon it should be up after this video maybe before i don't know yet but you guys will see once that video gets out but yeah um y'all probably going to hear the washing machine in the background because you're washing the cover that we're going to take to the hospital um for me and then we got to wash the cover that we got to take for christian for, to the hospital as well so that's why y'all hear the washing machine back there so um yeah so i'm going to be showing you guys like the clothes i'm going to wear the products i'm going to take and then just some extra things some of the things i don't have over here with me because they're already up and ready to go which is her boppy that i'm going to be taking with us and then some of the other things we're going to be taking is like the chargers and the ipads and the cameras and all the extra stuff and snacks and stuff that you guys don't really need to see but you know that you're going to eventually end up packing that so i'm going to be packing of course some snacks some waters i got my water cup uh christian's going to be bringing his ipad i'm going to be bringing my macbook um of course we're blogging i'm so out of breath y'all i'm telling y'all 36 weeks it's thursday and i'm feeling it so um yes yeah, so i'm there i'm bringing that um all that stuff and then we're bringing pillows and covers and stuff like that so yeah so i'm just going to show you guys what's going to be in my suitcase so let's go ahead and get into it it's not going to be that long so i'm going to go ahead and show you guys some of the toiletry things i'm going to be taking so the first thing of course my mom helped me pack my bag but i had to undo it to make sure i had everything on my list because i don't want to go to the hospital and i'm missing something and i know me i'm going to end up forgetting something so that's why i went ahead and re redid my list to make sure i have everything so we packed a few uh towel i got a towel and then i got a few rags because they said they give you some at the hospital but i'd rather have of course my own because it's nothing like having your own towel and rag and then i'm going to throw those away because i know they're going to get destroyed after a while so uh yes yeah, so i packed some towers and rags and then i got this really cute uh kendall and kylie toiletry bag and i think i got this from marshall's i think my mom bought me this from marshall's so yes yeah, so i got this cute kylie and kendall jenner bag and then i have um my uh nipple butter in here and then my cousin, she had bought me and Christian some cute little grip socks. So mine's uh, like little burden socks. So it's like, what this one say? It's like, ah, push it real good. And then it's the, ooh, baby, baby. So I got some of those socks and then I got some other socks for me and Christian as well. And then of course, I'm going to be bringing my soap and then to help me use the bathroom because i know you have to do number two before you leave the hospital i just got some of this stuff it's like a laxative which it is a laxative and then i just drank some of this to help me use the bathroom and then in this little cute um army department right here i think my mom yep so she put of course you're going to need your deodorant and then i have some toothpaste and then I have, of course, my toothbrush. And then she has my loofah in here. And then she, instead of lotion, she just gave me my vitamin E oil to help me with my stretch marks and everything. And if you guys have stretch marks, please tell me how to get rid of them. Because they're not on my stomach, they're on my butt. And they're like horrible on my butt. So that's that. So I need help definitely getting that off. And then in this second bag, I just have some, um, I think the always discreet um diapers so i'm gonna be wearing diapers just like my baby 
So, uh, yeah, so, and I just got the black one. These are the overnight ones. And my cousin also told me about these, and they're super, super stretch, stretchy and comfortable. Um, oh, that's cool. So, it is literally like a diaper, literally. I didn't even, I've never looked at these. My mom just packed my bag for me, and I just repacked it. So, yeah, so I have, like, four to five of those in here. And then she just put a couple of these, um, uh, milk storage bags and a couple of the actual storage covers for my breasts. Trying to see what else she put in here. So I'm looking at this just like like y'all looking at me open all this stuff. So um, yeah, so I got a few diapers in here, and I know the hospital, of course, is going to give you all this stuff, but it doesn't hurt to bring your own just in case, so you can see what's you know if you like which one you like more. So, um, yeah, let me zip this up real quick. All right, so the next thing, of course, I'm gonna take some of these out are just the always maxi pads. I'm gonna end up deciding if I wanna put another one on with just, if I wanna do this with just, um, if I wanna do the pad with just uh, some underwear and a waist trainer or just use a um, diaper. So I wanna at least have some choices. So I'm probably gonna take out like two to three of these just to put in there. Like I said, I know the hospital is gonna give me everything I need. So yeah, I just want to be prepared and have everything as well. Um, so the next thing is um, just these really, really tight spandex to help everything, you know, stay in place and try to suck my stomach back in after a while. And I definitely have to get like this waist trainer because I want one after I have the baby. I definitely want to snap, 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 snap back. I was gonna say snatch back. Well, yeah, snatch back. I can snap or snatch back. But yeah, I definitely want to get back smaller. But yeah, so I just got some black and then some tan. And then I also got some bras from Target. And these are, let me turn this around. These are the nursing bras and these right here, they just come down so I could just, let me, y'all can't see the white one. So let's, oh, they're stuck together. It's okay. But um, so I just pulled this down and I can nurse her as, um as needed so i'm going to definitely try to breastfeed but we're going to see how that goes or whatever so i'm just going to take these two nursing bras and then i just got a extra shirt for whenever i leave or whatever and then i got some uh super tight spandex and then i just got two pair of uh big big granny panties and then i have our outfit so when we take let me turn this bright brightness down some y'all hold on Okay, so now you can see it. So I have our um, little mommy and me outfits that I got from our baby shower. So it comes with her bow and her swaddle. And then it comes with my little robe. So we'll be taking pictures in this. And then I also have her Hello World sign right here. So we'll just write her name, her birthday, the height and the weight. And then when she take her pictures, she'll be taking her pictures with her little sign. And then I also packed me a Perry bottle. I know the hospital will give you one, but like I said, I want to at least have options just in case I don't like the hospital ones. I could at least try mine. And um, yeah, so I got just my little Perry bottle. So I can just use mine or I can use the hospital one, either one. Cause I know some people say they like the hospital one better or they like the one that they brought. So I just want to at least have an option to choose which one I'm more comfortable with. And then also I'm going to be bringing my fan that I'm going to um, hook to the side of the hospital bed and I'm going to be using this because I know people said they've been hot. They get hot during labor and they just be doing this or get a cool rag. I'd rather have a fan if, if needed. So we went ahead and got me one of these as well. And then I don't know if I'm taking both of these or not because I'm taking the other bras, but just uh, this is a nursing bra. They're both nursing bras and they both come down and you can put the pump in there. If y'all can see that. You can put the pump in there and um, it does it, you know, it's the bra that holds the pump. So this is this will be perfect for if I got guests in there and stuff like that. I can still be covered, but still uh, pumping as well. And then um, I have some dermaplast to help my cuckoo heal if she comes out that way. Hopefully she does. Hopefully I ain't gotta get a C-section, but yes, yeah, so I got some dermaplast as well. And then on to the clothes, the clothing items. So I have two like style nightgowns. I just couldn't choose, so I end up, I'm gonna end up gonna take 
both of them i think i showed you guys this in one of the videos before but it's just this cute black little nighty and i thought this is so cute so this is a short sleeve one this one's really cute and then this one comes with the shorts so i can wear this either after she gets here or if i want to go home in that or something and then if it's really cold in there i have a long sleeve one as well it's not the shirt isn't long sleeve but the pants is long so and it just says blessed on there which is really really cute and then i just have the long pants to go with it and then the last thing i have is just a plain black robe if i just want to wear my bra and my diaper and if i just get chilly if i just want to wear my bra and my diaper i can wear my robe on top and it's black and y'all this jump is so soft it is so soft so yeah i end up getting everything black because of course you're gonna be bleeding you're gonna be going through a lot so you don't want to want to really wear color colors so i was like black it just it's i don't know black it, and i was like that with my cycle i just wore black because i couldn't do like the colors and stuff and having to worry about this and that and this and that so so yeah that is pretty much everything that i have in my hospital bag because like i said the last little bit of things is the cover and the chargers and the ipads and all the extra stuff that's going to go in there so I'm pretty much ready. I'm excited. Oh, I also have to have my birth. I, I got to print out my birth and plan. And I got to print out, of course, my insurance card, my Medicaid card, uh, my driver's license, who's going to be in the room, uh, if I want to have a C-section, if anything goes wrong, or if I'm going to get the epidural and stuff like that. But y'all can do that if y'all want to. Y'all don't have to. But that's just something that I'm going to be doing. Because I know me, once I'm in there, I'm going to have my little speaker on gonna be meditating gonna be having my music going trying to focus because i know once some contractions hit it's gonna be a little rough but i'm gonna breathe through it i'm like whoo woosa, woosa. i'm gonna do something but yeah so um yeah so that's pretty much everything i have in my diaper bag i mean my hospital bag didn't go overboard because i feel like the hospital is going to give you my eyes twitching the hospital is going to give you majority of the stuff you need so you really just need to bring yourself the baby of course and then just a couple little outfits and stuff like that i do have my shower shoes and they're just going to be some crocs and then if not crocs i'm going to get some throwaway flip-flops and then i'm going to bring my uh crocs with me because i have like two pair of crocs and they're really comfortable um her car seats are already ready it's just i'm so excited y'all so um i don't think i missed anything because i really don't you really don't need much when you go to the hospital i feel like sometimes people overpack and then when you get home it's just dang i packed too much stuff but you can't it don't hurt to overpack because you never know what you might and might not need so yeah so that's the end of this video i hope you guys enjoy it make sure you like comment and subscribe if i missed anything or think i missed anything y'all comment down below um i don't think i missed anything i think i'm good so praying for a regular regular natural birth well vaginal birth i'm gonna definitely probably get the epidural but i don't know yet but just praying for that super easy birth calm birth good baby happy mama happy daddy healthy everybody so yeah so uh if you are a new mama congratulations if y'all already had your baby y'all comment down below how did your labor go how did the delivery go how did the afterbirth go because i want to know because there's so many things i see on tiktok that people don't say about birth that it's just like girl i did not know that happens after like what in the world but yeah so um yeah so i'm not gonna hold y'all up much longer so make sure you guys like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video